Hello all, uh, Search here for another, uh, I guess, haul unboxing, so, I uh, got a couple packages of stuff in today. Uh, so one of them is from Smart Doll Land, and the other is from uh, Choose Shine on Etsy. Uh, mostly shirts, but a couple hats. Uh, so we're gonna see what we got here. Uh, today's uh, model for a few items is going to be Felicity here in T. So we will go ahead and start opening these packages. We're gonna start with the Smart Doll order because that is the smaller of the two, which for me is surprising. So let's get it out of the DHL bag and we've got another brown envelope. Haven't got one of the envelopes in a while because most of what I've been ordering has been uh, larger items. So we've got a few things in there. So we'll start with the uh, smaller stuff. So. Felicity's not going to try this on because she would be the uh, complete wrong uh, tone for this. But we have the uh, milk bodysuit. So here is the bottoms for legs and torso. You have the uh, section for the bust. I'll be probably putting these on Chitose here later. Uh, I know she's probably washed out right now, but she's there because there's a lane in a kimono, and then we've got Monday or Kenzie sitting here with a Britannia dress. And then we've got the arm sleeves. So that we'll put up for right now because. They actually popped up uh, randomly on the uh, Small Dog website, and I missed them on the first go, so had to get them. Uh, next, we have the uh, brown slouch beanie. I uh, already have the uh, cyan one, so this gives me both of those. So we'll go ahead and we'll put this on Felicity because Felicity hasn't uh, decided on what her name's going to be yet. I'm going to drop my knife. But there we go with that on her. So. There's that. She'll keep that on for now, so we'll just uh, set that bag to the side. Pick up my knife. Then, third last item, because we've got one more after this. We have the brown weathered satchel. I've got the green one of these, which is right here got a couple of uh, buttons on it but we have the brown one and then so we've got one small pocket here that uh, Danny shows you can I guess put one or two sets of hands in there and then you have the larger pocket where the uh, uh, shoulder strap is at and these are just quick and easy to put on here so, this one for right now will probably go to uh, Udachi, my uh, Fortitude, because it just matches her outfit so much better. And the part that we're actually going to start in, uh, mess with 
uh, Felicity here for a second because we're going to change her is this right here and this is the uh, yellow uneven hem sweater so we'll go ahead and we will uh, go ahead and change her we're gonna leave her uh, shoes on because we shouldn't need to change that on her on this one so let's go ahead and get her changed get hair out of the way Still, uh, because I got uh, Felicity as a pebble, she is my first tea girl, and I will have to figure out what she will have. So, uh, I don't have much extra optional parts for her yet. So here is the uneven hem uh, yellow sweater, which is pretty much a dress. So we'll get that put on. And then let's go ahead and slide these on the sleeves. As she gets dropped, her arm gets dropped. I have to put all those clothes back away because she'll probably stay in this for a little bit. Fortunately, I don't really have any shoes for her to wear right now with this, but I've got some I've. Uh, eventually got to order for various things so, there we go we will show off her in the uh, sweater so fits very nice looks pretty good on her as the uh, tea so there we go I will still need to get different busts because all I have for her is the standard bust but there we go for that looks very nice on her bunches up uh, nicely at the bottom there so it looks great so there is Felicity and so we can see her and her head's not chopped off, we will just put her back down there. So there's that. And we're not gonna do we're not gonna do changing of these, but we're gonna open what's in this bag, which is from uh Cheetah Shine. Its package actually arrived a lot earlier than it was uh expected. I wasn't expecting this package for another it's Wednesday. Wasn't expecting it until the 19th, which is five days away. Thursday, Thursday. Yep, five days away. But it showed up five days early. So, there we go. And it is quite a bit of stuff. So, let's. So we have, uh, some, this, this came with her last one, so we have a, uh, a lace paper uh, cup placement thing, but that comes with it and then she sends these little envelopes with them that have stuff in them. So let's see what we have today. 
Ah. So I got this. Uh, I think it's just paper, the way it looks. Yeah, don't want to try peeling it apart if it's not supposed to, but got this little paper, uh, little uh, pink or coral girl. And on the uh, back, because uh, where this comes from, it says, uh, with love from Russia. So, that's cute. Didn't get this uh, in the last one. But it, you also get a little uh, paper flower. So, that's nice. And this one actually came with a leaf also. So, there's those. Nice little uh, addition to the uh, order. So that'll sit over to the side, and then we'll get into all of the shirts. So first things off, we're going to show off. So I'm a huge Star Wars fan, so when I saw these two, I had to uh, get them. So she had uh, uh, one that had the uh, First Order uh, emblem with a uh, First Order Stormtrooper on the front. So we've got that. And her packaging is really nice because you've got a uh, little uh, cheetah shine. It's got uh, Chitose on a sticker on the front. And then to keep them uh, in the shape, she also sends cards that have a picture of Chitose. I've got a bunch of these now because this is my second order from her. But gives information, tells you, uh, and says thanks for ordering. So, and they're really nicely made. I've got, uh, three or four of the shirts from her. So, uh, setting these to the side as a collection, but, yeah, shirts are nicely made. The, uh, uh, images are put on there nicely and they don't, uh, come off so here we have the uh, first order of stormtroopers on a white tee then um, we've got another Star Wars one which we'll uh, worry about opening later on uh, which is going to be the Millennium Falcon and Star Wars so that's on a black one and cool thing is I've actually had my girls wear uh, the black tees from her for about a week or so and have had no issue personally with staining so I'm not going to say everybody else is not going to have an issue but I haven't seen any issue with staining. So we've got that one. We've got uh, two hoodies and I'm actually going to pull these out because this first one is really cool looking. So she actually uh, posted and talked about uh, this one because it's got uh, paper uh, people on it so I've got I've got these both in the uh, dusty pink because I liked it hopefully it'll stay better but you've got the uh, dragon there and then on the hood you have a paper person on there hiding to uh, follow the dragon if you know what it's from and then you have another one on the back when I ordered I didn't realize that these were actually on the same uh, uh, sweatshirt as the uh, dragon, but she showed pictures. I'm like, oh well, I, that's the one I always ordered. So, and then the front pocket doesn't go all the way through, uh, but you do have two pockets here. So, do that. And it does stretch, so, but looking at it, you would have to take off, uh, on, um, of course, the head, but uh, the arms also because it's not a uh, zipper hoodie. Uh, so, but it is really nice. So we'll set that here to the side. Uh, then, uh, and these ones are on a little bit different than the uh, uh, t-shirts because they're a lot better. So they're in uh, this packaging. So you've got a pretty much an eight, uh, eight and a half by eleven piece of paper, uh, kind of metallic that has uh, Cheetah Shine's uh, information up there, so got that. And then here is the other one. 
Uh, this one is just really simple. It just has uh, this picture. And to me, it looks like Rukia from uh, Bleach, which is one of the reasons I liked it because I like the character. And uh, the anime is not bad. It kind of got weird towards the end, but it's a bad. Plus, I actually have uh, a replica of her uh, katana. So I've got the uh, with the white sheet and everything like that. So it's really nice. It's same, uh, like I said, same color as the uh, uh, dragon one. So got two of those. This gives me a few more sweat uh, sweatshirts for uh, the fall and colder season for them for my girls to stay warm in. And then for the last two items, they're in the uh, smaller bags, and they are. Two beanies. So I got a, uh, I guess you would say baby blue uh, rib knitted one. And I got a, I guess a heather gray uh, one that's not knitted, but they both had these cool little. Uh, uh, tags on them so let's see that's on the blue ribbed one if you can see that well and then this is what's on the gray one so those are real nice so we're gonna take off the uh, slouch beanie for the moment and we're gonna show you what uh, these two look like so we'll start with the blue This looks right on it. So there's the blue one. Got the uh, little patch to the side. Looks really nice. They fit nicely. They're uh, decently tight. And if you want to, you can just roll it down, cover their eyes, and they can just be wandering around blind. But that wouldn't be a good thing because. Then they bump into things and pick up wooden spoons and start trying to run after you. So that's not good. But there is that one. So we'll take the uh, blue one off so we can show you the uh, gray. Now the gray is more of a vice. This one being the ribbed uh, knit look. This one is more of like a, I guess a sweatshirt material. Uh, for the way it looks but we'll go ahead and put that there so that's what the gray one looks like and there you have the uh, patch again on the side so there's that which it looks nice I don't know if it goes well with the uh, yellow dress so we'll uh, figure something out, out if she wants to wear a hat We'll get something that uh, out of one of the multitude of hats I have uh, for them. Only person that's not going to wear them is Kenzie, because Kenzie hates hats. She she doesn't like them. So, Danny, if you watch this, yeah. My Kenzie, which is uh, Monday, she doesn't like to wear hats. She she knocks them off all the time. But, uh, so there we go with the... Uh, everything we picked up so not a bad haul uh, so we picked all that up and uh, yeah that's gonna be about it for today if you uh, enjoyed the video please like comment and subscribe wherever down here and uh, I will see everybody on the next review which will be uh, one of those Figma, which you can't tell what they are, so I will choose, except for this one. Where is it? At? Except for that one, because I've already done that review. I unfortunately have two of those, so. Yes, those right there. But, uh, thanks for watching, and, uh, y'all have a great day.